good morning my dear students today we are going to discuss about the paper i know already we have solved you have already solved the physics paper which on the base of topic light yes or no so today i'm going to discuss the paper so just see the first question is object which emits the light by their own are called yes luminous object what which which type of the object luminous object and in front of that you have to write the reason what is the reason the right, you will write it is the definition it is the definition now the second c a torch bulb is which type of the object luminous non luminous transparent or translucent yes it emits the light it is the artificial source of light torch bulb is a artificial source of light or it is a human made light so it is the luminous object it emits the light so it is it 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 is the luminous object then the c third we can see the object of it why do we can see the object c if the light is not there can we see the objects in the dark no we can see the object because it reflects the light the object reflects the light so we are able to see the object so we are able to see the object are you getting so answer is b third answer is b fourth answer a natural source of light is of course sun sun is the prime source of energy yes or no so it is called as the natural source of light the natural source of light is sun then the next is also a star is also a natural source of light a band of seven color obtained on a screen after reflection from the prism is called spectrum it is called as a spectrum so it is the definition it is the definition sixth one a light can travel through all of the above that is vacuum the light can travel through vacuum gas in the liquid yes or no so all of the above is the correct answer seventh one the glass bottle is transparent then mirror glass is mirror is which type of an object yes it is the opaque object already we have discussed this in the last video a uh, mirror is not a transparent object it is the opaque object so the d is the correct option next is what is the color order of the for the color when passes through the prism though so we have discussed about the rainbow yes or no at that time i have given the color band am i right so the correct order will be red yellow blue violet red yellow blue violet according to the given option so you have to write which colors the rainbow has yes or no that you know that you have written in the notes the sh shadow of an object is formed in the direction where do where do the shadow is formed yes when the always the shadow forms in the opposite direction of an object see when the light is passing through it my shadow will form on this blackboard yes or no so shadow is always form opposite direction of an object okay 10th one an inverted image is the characteristics of which means the given options are shadow pinhole camera reflected image laterally inverted image the answer is pinhole camera the answer is pinhole camera the inverted image we get here inverted image then moon and planets are they are which type of an object transparent translucent or opaque they are the opaque object they are the opaque ob object see we can see uh, we can see the light in the during night we can see the light on the moon am i right but the light we get from the sun that light it get from the sun as the moon is the moon is moon is the opaque object it reflects the light it reflects the light so the option is that moon and planet reflects the light energy from the sun are you getting 
so we are able to see the moon during night the pinhole camera is a simple application of what is the uh, application or what is, uh, what we can say what is the characteristics of the pinhole camera it is based on the principle of rectilinear propagation of light so what is meant by the rectilinear propagation of light that light always travels in a straight line light always travel in a straight line for this we have done the activity yes or no we ha i have shown the activity how the light travels in a straight line so the pinhole camera is a simple application of rectilinear propagation of light see on this base the th 13th question is there rectilinear propagation of light it light it means the light always travels in a straight line then the next c14 the road has a reflector to help the people see the center line how does the reflector work now see if you if you if you might have seen during the night the on the road side there are some uh, uh, reflector yes or no so what what is the use of that it reflects the light it reflects the light means what happens when the uh, when the car lights falls on that reflector it bounces back the light so that we are able to see that is the age of the road yes or no so so we are able to see the age of the road so the correct op option will be it bounces the light back it bounces the light back are you getting the light from the sun reaches the earth is yes the answer is 8.33 minutes already we have discussed this a solar eclipse occurs only on when does the solar eclipse occur it mainly occurs during the new moon day it mainly occurs during the new moon day a solar eclipse is caused when what is the actually the concept behind the solar eclipse the moon comes between the sun and the earth the moon comes between the sun and the earth are you getting which one of the following does not have mass and a volume now which the options which are given can you tell me which one will do, does not have the mass or the volume yes of course light light does not have the mass or the volume which one of this thing gives out light which one of the following gives the light that is moon moon is not a moon is an opaque object mirror is also an opaque object a burning fire yes it emits the light so the correct option is c shiny things such as mirror appear shiny because they why does the shiny things now if you might have seen the spoon plates they are shiny why why are they shiny because they reflect more amount of light because they reflects the more amount of light so answer a is correct the size of the shadow of an opaque object close to the screen and away from the source of the light then what will be uh, whether the size of the shadow will increase decrease remain the same or first decrease and then increase so the answer will be c the size of a shadow of an opaque object close to the screen close to the screen away from the source of light if the source of light is away then what will be the size of the shadow it will also decrease as the you know, source of a light uh, uh, the distance between the source of the light and the object is more the shadow will also get decrease the shadow will also get decrease then 22 when an object blocks the path of the light what shape of the shadow is formed when an object blocks the path of the light mean suppose the light is falling and when a particular object will come in between the source of the light then what shape of the shadow is formed the shadow will be similar as the as to the object a dark box no shadow is formed none of the above a shadow will form as the it is an opaque object we have discussed the shadow uh, for the sh to form a shadow we need an opaque object and we can see the outline of the particular object yes or no so shadow will 
form as same as the particular object now 23rd in may 2012 across the pacific side the earth people watches the annual solar eclipse due to the why due to the tip of the umbra falls on the earth due to the tip of the umbra now what is umbra and what is penumbra that we have discussed umbra is nothing but a dark part of the shadow yes or no and penumbra is nothing but faint part of the shadow are you getting so due to the tip tip means small point it is called as a tip of the umbra falls on the earth then which of this object would reflect the most light now which object will reflects more light yes the shiny object which are the shiny object will reflect more light or the smooth object so the answer will be c a polished metal knife will uh, reflect more light you can see yourself in mirror mirror clearly because mirror is a transparent no mirror is opaque mirror reflects all the all the light yes mirror reflects all the light so we are able to see ourselves clearly see water is also a transparent am i right if it is a steady then we can see uh, we can we can get your uh, we can get our image properly but if the water is moving then we cannot get means what happens at that time the some part of the light gets reflected and others uh, other part or some part it get absorbed so we are unable to see the image properly in the water but in the mirror we can get our image clearly because all the lights get reflected i hope you have understood all the explanations so today's work will be you have to check your paper and write the reason for it thank you